Schalke are on the cusp of a European place, but it's been slow going so far for Wolfsburg. At least John Brooks could finally make his debut after his summer move from here to Berlin. Wolfsburg thought they'd gone in front early when Mario Gomez headed home Maximilian Arnold's free kick, but the flag had rightly gone up for offside. Then it was Wolfsburg's turn to get a let off. An excellent driving run from Amin Arit, whose shot deflected off Brooks, but somehow Kuhn Castells at full stretch managed to turn it onto the post. The replay captures the magnificence of the save, Arit still waiting for his first Bundesliga goal. The breakthrough came in controversial circumstances just before half-time. Referee Marcus Schmidt didn't see anything wrong when bodies went sprawling from the corner, but video assistant Marco Fritz ruled that Josua Gilavogi had his arms all over Tilo Keira. The Wolfsburg man was booked, the penalty given and converted by Nabil Bentaleb. His third of the season all at home and all from the spot. So 1-0 at the break thanks to Bentaleb in the side for the injured Leon Goretzka. Wolfsburg were better in the second period but still might have gone two down when Ochipka's free kick missed by a whisker. But back on the hour, Naldo challenged Yannick Gerhardt, and although he won the header, he made plenty of contact with the player too. Another video review, and another penalty. Skipper Mario Gomez stepped up, but spooned the spot kick over the top. His standing foot clearly slipped on the turf, the first penalty he's missed for over six years. Then deep into stoppage time, Martin Schmidt's side got their leveller. Arnold's ball forward, won in the air by Gomez, for substitute Divock Origi to pounce from close range. The Belgians third of the campaign, and it means six straight draws now for Wolfsburg. He finished one apiece at the Veltins Arena.